probably in the world. The general that died in office under unclear circumstances, not a long-term disease. We need to know. Generals don't just die. We need to know. I would still say presidents don't just die. They also fade away. It's rare occasions that presidents die in office. And if they die, it's through clear circumstances, natural circumstances, not helicopter crash. I'll give an example of former general and president of South Sudan, Maya Ditch. Uh, Garang. He didn't just die. It went down. So he should have faded away. And that's why there was inquiry in uh, the course of the helicopter going down in a forest. And they searched to get his body. It was an inquiry. And uh, still closure is not met. Mm -hmm. So it's very important to understand how the causes of death. And as a medic, there are three things we do. You do post-mortem, you do autopsy, and you do, I've forgotten the third one, uh, where you do investigation autopsy. So there is a name, I'll remember, I'll, 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 I'll say it. And uh, we want to go to the third one and continue. Uh, Kenya is in the mood of mourning and more so the Luo nation, yes. where I also come from. The only community in the country that have suffered the most and paid the price of so many things in this country. And the only community I'll take pride with that has fought for, multi, for so much democracy in this country. And as they were doing that, they've lost many of their elites. We started off many years ago with a political assassination of the first in the Luo nation, Ofafa. Councillor Ofafa, Ofafa Jericho, Ofafa Maringo, Ofafa. A guy from Siaya. From Ofafa, we've had a numerous lineup of people. We've had even the first lawyer ever in Kenya who was going to court standing in for Mau Mau prisoners. Aguenge Kodek. In law, we call him Aguenge. We don't say a going, a going Again, a son of Siaya. 